last couple of runs I've had, I've been getting a bunch of uh, where it's losing its vacuum. Draws down to like minus or to 250 millitors at start up, but then during the freezing process, it loses all that and goes up to 2,500. And I'm thinking that it might be my O-rings in, in the hose. Let's see if I can see that little black ring in there. That is an O-ring, and there's one in each end, and those can, can leak. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to dig that out. Now you want to be real careful in here. You do not want to scratch that at all. Because if you scratch that, you are going to cause a leak. I mean, you want to be really, really careful getting that out. If you have a toothpick, I've got these skewers. And that wood I know is not going to scratch that brass ring. So you just kind of poke that out like that, get it loose. And it'll come right out. Now I bought some of these off of Amazon and I'll give you the details. I bought a bag of a hundred of them. They were cheap enough. I can't remember what I paid but it wasn't much. And what you do is you just put that in there and you got to work that into that groove. There you go. Kind of kind of just like you just kind of got to roll it get one side started and roll it into the groove all the way around so there you have it there's one there's two now we're gonna go put this on the freeze dryer and let's see if we can get a good vacuum well sadly that did not fix my vacuum link uh, leak so I have ordered a new door rubber gasket on close inspection of that I've discovered that the uh, when you open it up where's my old one when you open it up and look on the inside there you can see some of that cords so that's probably what the problem is so that should be here pretty soon. Uh, tracking number says it might get here Sunday, so hopefully you all see a video of me freeze drying next week. But I'm going to go ahead and upload that this, this week, because even though this did not repair my vacuum leak, it's a good thing to know and a relatively inexpensive thing to replace these little O-rings and make sure that they're good. So... Uh, it's just one of the checks, and I'll, I'll probably call this uh, vac unable to, to achieve vacuum number two. Because <laughs> I did one on flushing my standard pump, how to flush those. So, although this was not a success in solving my problem, I, hopefully you got some good information from this. And I look forward to seeing you in the next freeze dryer load.